Hey, this is Bob from the Barry Auction, and we are having an auction Thursday night, June 30th at 6. I'm going to do box lots around 6.15. I have a ton of box lots, and I want to tell you right now, this video won't even give you an idea. It'll give you a small idea of what I have. My trucks are full, my van's full, my shed's full, uh, storage area is full, and I uh, it just all somehow seems to come together on the day of the auction, but I'll show you some stuff right now. I'm going to start over here. There's a really nice uh, country, uh, that is a um, corn chopper, right? Uh, nice country piece there. There's a nice antique round table there. Look at this grain bin. It's in... Uh, reddish paint and it has some advertising on it or name or something C.A. Rockberg or something like that. Uh, there's a rocker over there. There's a uh, hutch of some kind. That desk, it, if you look on Auction Zip, this desk is uh, 1800s and there's a chair and, and the inkwell goes with it. Uh, it looks really nice when it's set up. I'm not completely set up like I said. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna, to um, Auction off these bookshelves. Also back there is a tobacco case that I've had here for a while. A lot of people have shown interest in it uh, in the past. It's wood. It has lighting on the inside. It's really nice. It's an old uh, tobacco display case. I'm going to auction that off. i got a bureau there. There's a uh, humpback uh, chest. There's a really nice early church pew with a uh, cushion. There's another uh, table there. There's a bedroom set. That's really uh, heavy, hard. It's, I believe it's rock maple. Look at this box. It's all tongue and grooved. And, uh, you can tell that's very old. It's got initials in it. JJ. Old toolbox. There's an, uh, another box in red there. There's the, the uh, chair that goes to the desk. There's a... Uh, that's an oak bureau. There's a nice marble top bureau there. Uh, and on top of that is a, a mantle mirror, antique one. There's a nice trencher over there, wooden one. There's other stuff over here that's uh, miscellaneous. Uh, I haven't got it all together yet. There's a bookshelf there. I also have some coins. I got Morgan silver dollars and uh, uh, Walking Liberty. Uh, there's a barrel there. There's another chair. Birdcage. Uh, this is some of the other. This is a couple. That's a blower motor to a. Uh, oh, a. Uh, you know, where you melt metal. There's a uh, student lamp there, a nice antique student lamp. Lone brow sign. There's a piece of uh, Roseville. A nice pedestal there. Is it an electric guitar? Uh, natural finish. There's an Indian uh, style dish. Um, a crock. There's a needle point. That's an old one too. Look at the back of this. It's a, it's a wooden old type. There's a clock scale. There's a nice hand painted uh, uh, piece there. There's a country mirror. There's a Superman. Lunchbox and a piece of art. Look at this here. This is one of the fe this is one of the featured pieces. Uh, a nice Victorian, never changed. This is an oil lamp, and it's beautiful. And it's a nice big one. I'll show you from a distance there. Next to that is another antique lamp uh, with a metal base and the green top. Uh, there's a nice piece of uh, crystal there, uh, painted rocker, a nice country piece there. There's a Reading crock. Uh, where's the other crock? I have a real nice crock here that I don't see at the moment. Oh, there it is. Got a beautiful crock here. And it's uh, Beaumont Pottery, York, Maine. Uh, nice, nice piece of pottery there. There's a uh, cookie jar and a, a, a Victorian stool, the rocker. There's some cards, collector cards, 
and a Schwinn bike, no, it's a Columbia bike. There's an antique door stop. I got about three or four of those different ones. There's another one, it's a uh, cat. There's a rooster one and some pottery. There's a bust of W.C. Fields. Kind of cool. Uh, there's some die cast cars. Behind that is we sell Ray Vestos. Uh, brakes, that's a metal sign. There's a Texaco sign there. There's another Ray Bestos one. Th there's tons and tons of stuff. I mean, I could keep going and going and going. And I'm not even set up yet. Uh, there's an old uh, ice cream container. Nice early paint uh, picture of a cat. There's some trivets, a uh, trivet lot. This lamp is beautiful too. It's an antique lamp, oil lamp that hangs. Uh, it's going to turn the wrong way on me, but it's really nice. you got to see this in person probably to get the full effect. But there's some brass uh, wall hangings that aren't dented or anything like you usually find them. And there's a bowl and a picture that goes with it, which you don't usually see. Uh, there's some copper, uh, a tea set there. Uh, let's see, that's a stone... Uh, flower pitcher. There's some early uh, pictures and photos. Uh, candle holders. This is some antique, 10 yards of antique fabric. There's a Stetson hat and a box. I think this was on. You should go on, uh, this looks better out of the box. You should go on uh, Auction Zip. Look under Auctioneer Bob Jackson and you'll see a lot of stills. Nice wooden bowl and a ladle sign painting there. There's some other uh, good paintings. There's some other stuff over there. Uh, toys and uh, there's a M and M thing. This is Gone with the Wind lamp. Really nice. Coca-Cola stuff over there. Uh, I'm just going to go on. There's a cuckoo clock. That's an owl. Victorian and there's some good jewelry. Uh, hmm, this isn't the one. There's some Victorian stuff in there. Look at this um, printers block there. It's brass and it's, it's an old one. This is 1840s on the side here. Oops, I should go that way. Uh, crystal. There's a butter churn. There's some textile uh, stuff in that lot. Uh, spindles and whatnot. There's some shuttles that they made. Some of them are just as is, but as they were, but uh, other ones they made a couple lamps out of in the candle holder. The stuff I haven't even, uh, this may be a box lot, I don't know, I need to go through it. There's another one, there's tons of box lots. We're going to be outside at 615 because I got so much stuff. And I'm going to run as much stuff as I possibly can. Uh, so there'll be a lot to be had here. Uh, so it's tomorrow night, well, it's Thursday night. This stuff I'm not going to show you right now. It's, oh, I'll show you this though, okay. This aisle is jammed. This stuff, a lot of it's going outside. There's furniture. There's a rocking horse. There's a couple of them. There's stuff down there. Uh, this whole aisle is blocked with. There's a vintage radio down there. There's furniture. There's stuff out here. Uh, chairs and this truck is full. Uh, well, it's, I'm getting there with it, but there's a beautiful drop leaf table in there. There's, uh, I think, stick leaf furniture in here. pretty full of stuff uh, and like I say my van is full of smalls and uh, there's boxes in here too but uh, tomorrow night uh, I'd get here at 6 you can eat here and uh, hang out and the auction is going to start shortly after the, the, the inside auction will start at 6.30 the box is going to start somewhere between that 1797 West Street in Barry Mass oh yeah forgot this Tons and tons of jewelry. Boxes and boxes and boxes of jewelry. Uh, there's a nice pitcher lamp there. There is a uh, driftwood lamp. Really nice. I have swords. Uh, well, I have a sword. I have a World War II bayonet. Uh, like I say, I have the Morgan Dollars and 